Since the mid-1930s, all the German armed forces and intelligence departments had adopted a standard machine for encoding their messages. The cipher machine E, better known as Enigma. It was developed in the early 1920s as a handy tool for businessmen to keep commercial messages secret. It was powered by a battery, and its encoded messages were transmitted in Morse code to be decoded on a second Enigma machine at the receiving end. As a result, each letter typed could come up in any one of 150 million ways. Given the almost infinite number of settings, it was not surprising that the Germans remained convinced throughout the war that Enigma was uncrackable. It was the Poles who took the first steps in solving this baffling puzzle. They knew of the existence of the Enigma machine and recruited a strange collection of mathematicians, chess masters and crossword puzzle experts to continue the decoding. Marian Rzewski, Jerzy Rzewski and Henry Zygalski. But the team could not decipher messages without knowing the internal wiring of the rotors. The solution was supplied by French intelligence, which sent its Polish allies material gathered by a spy in the German army's cipher department. Amongst this was an Enigma manual. The Poles were able to reconstruct an Enigma machine and began laboriously decoding messages. time Poland fell to the Germans, the Polish cryptographers had destroyed all evidence of their work on Enigma. Some were captured and tortured. But I gotta go work on some crossword puzzles. You're gonna suck my dick. The fuck is going on? Well, good luck with that one. <laughs> Come on, Russell. But, but I gotta take a fucking shit. The chink is right. He's gotta take a fucking shit. And while he's taking his little Chinese shit, you are going to blow me. And you're going to do it nice and softly because I like it that way. So I can come all over your fucking face. But none revealed what they've been up to. 